Shalom. Give honors and praise to Yahweh, Pashem, Yabasha, Raka, Kartash, double honor of GMS, Pastors and Elders, and our hopeful elect that teach on our ways and by ways and to edify, to learn, listen of the scriptures. Shalom to the brothers on highways and byways. I say shalom. Uh, just watched. Sorry, I just watched a video of uh, of the doc. Uh, I've got the, the 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 title of the video, but man, I forgot the name. But um. You know, we uh, we at that time that uh, uh, everything is moving. You know, according to uh, the uh movie, uh, because uh, uh, we haven't. Uh, a lot of people losing their jobs over AI. Uh, uh, the the the, uh, the Neuralink chip is being pushed. Uh, uh, famine of the word. Uh, hurricanes, tornadoes, earthquakes. Uh, tsunamis, uh, so we at the time of the end, I want to go into uh, Ecclesiastes chapter 25 verse 7, there be nine things which I have judged in my heart to be happy, and the tenth I will utter with my tongue. A man that hear, sorry, a man that had joy of his children, and he that lived to see the fall of his enemy. All right, so you gonna have the lack of the lack. Is holding on to see the fall of the enemies, and I pray that I be part of the lack. Um, Jeremiah 51 verse 7 Babylon has been a golden cup in the Lord's hand that made all the earth drunken the nations are drunk of her wine therefore the nations are mad Babylon is suddenly fallen and destroyed. Hollow for her. Take ball for her pain. If so, be she may be healed. But Babylon is not healed. Alright? Because every time Esau build, uh, the Lord tear it back down. Verse 9. We would have healed Babylon, but... She is not healed. Forsake her and let her, let us go everyone to his own country. So that's going to be the civil war, class war, race war. Everybody's going to try to flee uh, back to their own people. For her judgment reached unto heaven and is lifted up even to the sky. Um, yeah, we, yeah, we at the time, uh, the whole earth is going to be in fear. Job, um, chapter 21 and verse 20, his eyes shall see his destruction, you know, um, uh, 
Esau uh, pushing his uh, karama, you know, that uh, uh, Capri Sun juice, and he shall drink of the wrath of the Almighty. You know, as that Isaiah said, uh, who is that coming for Edom? Uh, Ezekiel chapter 9 verse 4 And the Lord said unto him Go through the midst of the city Through the midst of Jerusalem So Jerusalem was a people for a place And set a mark on the forehead Alright the mark on the forehead Is uh, The scriptures All right, this is uh, the spiritual mark of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh. Satan mark, his cardinal mark is, is that uh, implant device that he want to insert it into your forehead or your hands. Uh, I read that again. It says, set the mark on your forehead of the man that sighed and that cry for all the abomination that has been done in the midst of. All right, so you only have the Lord's men is sighing and cry for all the abomination on the earth. So, uh, you have the remnant of the elect is working out their salvation, all right? Uh, these are peculiar, peculiar men, all right? That's strange to the world. Uh, Revelation 20, I'm going to read that again. Revelation 22, verse 4. And they shall see his face. Sloppy. Yeah, Revelation 22, verse 4. And they shall see his face. And his name shall be on a forehead. So, that's the seal. That's going to be the seal of the 144,000. One moment. Um, second Ezra 4 verse 26. The answer he me and said, The more thou search, the more thou shalt marvel, for the world hasted fast to pass away. Because you got Joe Biden opened the border for uh, all the migrants, all right, which is majority of U.N. soldiers. Because uh, as it says in Isaiah 59 and 19, he's going to come down with his great wrath. You know? Let me get a... Uh, Revelation 12, verse 12. Therefore rejoice, heaven. It's like, therefore rejoice ye, heaven, and ye that dwell in them. Woe unto the habitants of the earth and of the sea. For the devil is coming down unto you having a great wrath because he know he has what a short time. Because uh, the Lord short the Lord shortened the days. All right? Because um, because uh, Esau Edom uh, 
pushing his chip, all right, and starting his World War Three. So the Lord is going to get his um, get his man out the way. Um, second as a no, yeah. Uh, Slocky. Uh, Ecclesiastica in Apocrypha, chapter two, verse sixteen. They that fear the Lord will seek that which is well pleasing unto Him, and they that love Him shall be filled with the law. You know, uh, one of Bruce Lee, one of Bruce Lee um, quotes. You um, I don't know the exact words, but he it's something go like uh. It was it was spiritual because. You know. He said, "You you can either. Blow or you can crash. You know you know he you know he he said be like water. So." I went into John 7, John um, 7 and verse 38. He that believe on me, as the scripture has said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. So, um, you know, that's what brothers um, um, be going on precept on precept. And only the remnant can get this true. Two thirds, uh, they try to follow, but they can't catch it. I'll get a couple more scriptures. Matthew 13, verse 11. He answered and said unto them, Because it is given unto you. To who? The, the, uh, the 144,000, the northern kingdom, the southern kingdom. All right? The remnant of his elect. Uh, because it's given unto you to know the mystery of the kingdom of heaven, but to them is not given. Verse 12. For whosoever hath, hath to him shall be given, and he shall have more abundance. But whosoever have not for him shall be taken away. Even that he had. So, uh, it's, it's um, not only going to get bad here in America, but the whole earth. You know, because, you know, I used to like hear people like, yo, when, when things pop on, they going back to their country, whatever. But wherever you go, you're going to find the same thing you left from. All right? Ain't going to be nothing but uh, death and destruction. All right? Um, I watched that video of Hassan. You know, after the thermal nuclear weapons hit this place, it's not going to be... Um, no, no, um, no weapons. I mean, none of um, the Russians' weapons to fight. Um, yeah, how about Shemi Because once they go down, that's it for them. All right, they're going straight into captivity. This is 
is not my, this is not my words, this is the Lord's word. Two more. Uh, Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 5, verse 14. For the hope of the ungodly is like dust that is blown away with the wind, like a thin frost that is driven away with the storm, like as the smoke which is dispersed here. And there, with a tempest, passed away as the rem uh, re remembrance of a guest that tarried but a day. Yeah, because the day of Mrs. Fly is going to be a lot of Sarah O'Connor's. Going to be like running for a... Uh, Running like roaches for cover. All right. So the remnant that the Lord, the, the, the remnant of Esau and these other nations, uh, you thinking you're seeking salvation, but you're going into captivity with Esau. Yes. You have benefit also you think uh, the heavenly father gonna let that slide the Lord said his eyes are uh, 10,000 times brighter than the sun um, he has to go back in the pocket for chapter 2 verse 13 woe unto him that is faint-hearted, for he believed not, therefore shall he not be defended. Verse 14, Woe unto you that have lost patience, and what will you do when the Lord visit you? Verse 15, The fear of the Lord will not disobey his word, and they that love him will keep his ways. Verse 16, they that fear the Lord will seek that which is well pleasing unto him. And they that love him shall be filled with the law. Verse 17, they that fear the Lord will prepare their heart and humble their soul in his sight. So I'm going to end this lesson. Kadar Judah. We got next.